Yo, what's good, family? It is your boy, A Trip, aka A3, the energy dealer, Renetta Sun. We are back. Welcome to the table. I'm happy you're back here with me. Uh, and yeah, we're gonna have a another little conversation. We like to we like to uh, tap in with the community, man, and just kind of let you know what I'm doing. Uh, even when I don't have another artist here or uh, another creative, uh, you know, I am an artist and a creative. So I will. Uh, how do you say? Interview oneself, right? <laughs> we'll do that. Uh, but no, nah, look, let me uh, tell you what I got going on. Um, and, and kind of just talk about some other things that are going on also, um, that I'm peeping and that I'm liking, right? Um, so for starters, my next show is going to be December the 16th, um, in Livingston, uh, at the Mint. Uh, it is a show, uh, that, that kind of has a, a very, uh, beautiful mission. And, uh, there's a lot of artists that are coming together to kind of help see this, this mission through, right? Uh, so it's a part of the Suffer Out Loud uh, campaign. Um, I'm not 100% sure uh, the names behind that, um, but I know that the cause is, is is for mental health. So it's to help, uh, you know, individuals that are going through things, um, maybe in the privacy of their homes or even just within their minds, right? And uh, it's encouraging them to reach out to, to people, reach out to, to their friends, reach out to the to the loved ones, uh, create safe spaces so that they can they can feel and start to heal uh, with whatever they're going through in life because we all are going through something in life, right? Um, so I really liked uh, the idea of that. That's the reason why I had to be a part of it. Um, shout out my guy, Buckshot, Kill It, um, I guess, a.k.a. Rob to a lot of you folks. I just I just call him Buck normally. Um, you know, I think it was like a year before I even knew his name was Robert. But uh <laughs> that's another story. But uh but shout out to him. Uh that's kinda how I found out about the show. Um there was another name, um, Nick Newhouse. Uh, I don't know if I know him personally either, but um everyone involved in putting together this thing to help out those who are suffering, shout out to you, right? Um I kinda got some thoughts on that too, on just like the the mental health movement, right? Because um, you know, there used to be times when when things like mental health weren't talked about. Um, they were taboo, almost as if they didn't exist, right? If you were going through depression, you were just you just needed to cheer up or something like that, right? Um, maybe if you had anxiety, you just needed to calm down, right? But in twenty twenty three, we we see that there are um, there are individuals that are that are dealing with situations that are very real, and and maybe we don't see them on the surface, but they're dealing with them. And just a part of being a human, I think that we should all care about doing the most we can um, to make sure the people around us don't go fucking crazy, right? I mean, because because listen, we're all kind of losing our minds a little bit, right? Like the world is the world is a crazy space. Uh, you know, I just lost my mother and my father, um, you know, a year apart, um, aunt, uncle, um, some best friends. It's, uh, it's been a very mentally challenging time, you know? Um, and I can't say that, well, I can't say that I've always reached out to people to try to, uh, to get through those times with friends. Uh, you know, I definitely have, have been in solitude a lot. Um, and just kind of being an introvert by nature, it, it was just, um, it was just, uh, intuition almost to just go in to resolve inside. Uh, but what I've been learning through this healing process is that having others, uh, there, even if it's just to, you know what I'm saying? Cry with you, listen to you. Sometimes just listen to you cry. Right. Um. Uh, just being around that genuine love um, or being around people that have genuine love and care for you, it's a healing energy in itself. Uh, whether or not you're, you're able to accept it properly um, or in a way that, that makes people feel like, like you're gracious, right? And a lot of times people need help. Um, they don't want to ask for help, um, but they can greatly benefit from it when it's given to them. 
So just to keep these things in mind, right? So when we do things like this, like this show, um, it's it, it's an avenue to give people help that aren't necessarily asking for it outright, um, but that can greatly benefit from it, right? And those are kind of the people that we want to help the ones the ones who 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 want to help themselves and and maybe they just deal with a little bit too too much pride to ask for it, right? I know I've dealt with it um, before in my past and. And, and and on that note, we all have friends specifically that are dealing with things that we know of. So um, reach out to those friends um, individually uh, on a personal level and and be there for them. Actually be there for them. Don't just say things like, you know, hit me up if you ever need to hit me up. You know, just actually be there for them. Um, and we can all do better at this. You know, I'm definitely talking to myself as well uh, in these moments. So I'm pretty uh, I'm pretty stoked about the show. Um, already got the set prepared, a uh, 30-minute set. Um, there's a few other artists that are going to be, a few other hip-hop artists that are going to be there with me. I think it's split to, like, different um, different genres. Maybe it's, like, one building and, like, three different venues in the building with different uh, genres kind of going on. Uh, I'm definitely on the hip-hop side of things. And I could be wrong, too, because I haven't really talked to anybody behind the scenes. But... Um, this is what I'm seeing from the surface. There's going to be some, um, a lot of bands playing out, out there in Livingston and about four or five other hip hop acts, including myself. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. I know for sure, like Buckshot and Filt and Foul. Um, I got to look at the, the poster to see everyone else that is involved because there's a lot of artists and it's, it, it, it's, it's amazing. So we're going to put together a night of great energy, uh, great vibes and, you know, donate to a good cause uh, to help out people that, that need some help. And hopefully if we find ourselves needing some help in the future, uh, we'll be able to get that as well um, because of just pouring into this community um this community caring act, if you will, showing that we care about the people, even if we don't know them directly, right? Cause they're part of our neighborhood. They're part of our community. Uh, they're part of our world. Um, so yeah, so that's going on December 16th. Uh, there's another show I wanted to talk about that I am not a part of, but, uh, I believe, uh, Buckshot is putting on this one as well. Um, band roulette, um, just just off glance off what he's been putting out there for the promotion it looks like he's grabbing a bunch of different um artists or a bunch of different like uh, musicians from the band pool here locally and he's just kind of roulette mixing them up pairing them with with each other maybe they've never worked together before uh maybe they've played shows at the same venues before but haven't you know actually worked on anything together he's putting them um all in bands and they're creating songs and uh, they're doing this all for a good cause as well. Um, they're going to play a show with these new songs that they created with their new bands. And the the benefiters are going to be the children. I believe it's Toys for Tots. Um, I believe it's Toys for Tots. So that's another good cause, right? Um, this shows that we can do something as a community, as musicians, um, that's bigger than us. It shows that we care as well, right? So th these are all good things that are happening. Um, and, you know, it's a part of the hip-hop community, a part of the underground music community in a whole. So we all have something to do with that. So let's uh, let's push these things. Let's stand behind these things. And let's kind of help, help those that need help out. Uh, shout out to uh, Nick Busy and Contact Filt and File. Uh, the show I did there um, on Friday at the break room that they put together. Um, a new venue, never had a hip-hop show there before. Um, definitely a small, intimate group of people there. Uh, mainly the rappers and maybe a few outside extended from them there to see the show. So intimate setting. Uh, we, we all got together. We performed. We, you know, it felt like we were in a dojo. Just kind of sparring doing our show, exchanging energy. So I really like that. Shout out to those guys. I hope to perform there more and, you know, to really, really fill the place out some. Um, shout out to the Kid Pluto. Uh, Dope-ass young artist out here. He's doing his thing. He, his energy, the energy around him is just very uh, gravitational. 
You know what I'm saying? You can definitely feel that he's he's in it. He does a lot of freestyle work. Um, that's dope. Uh, I'm looking forward to listening to some more of his art, some more of his um, some more of his written stuff, some more of his uh, his project stuff because the kid definitely is killing it. Uh, shout out to Enigma as well, who's always he's always down there for a local show, man. He's always jumping up there. He doesn't care if he has to go first. Uh, where he just gets out there and performs. You know, the songs that he's been writing over probably his entire life. You know, so you can always see the outpour of his emotion there. Um, yeah, everybody that came out, everybody that, that kind of chilled with us and, and caught the vibe. Shout out y'all. Uh, I'm really loving looking around and seeing so many hip-hop artists doing things and planning things. Um, Like, that just tells us that we're going to be here past today. You feel me? Uh, we're gonna be here past next week. We got shit planned into into next year. We got the I mean even the Rapping the Rivers uh, festival second time around is planned for next year as well. Um, again, felt and foul making those moves, doing things, keeping uh, keeping like this 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 hip hop almost currency flowing. You know, um, keeping it active. So uh, shout out to everybody that's just creating this place that we can call home, um, which is hip hop. Out in the mountains, right? Hip hop in the mountains, mountain music. Shout out mountain music. But look, I just want to jump on today with those quick few thoughts. Talk to the community. We do got some interviews um, planned out, and that will be here in the future. So you know, some more artists, some more interviews, some exciting things. Some uh, I don't want to say too much. I'm not good at not saying too much, but. I'm going to practice now. How many times do I have to tell you, madam? Oh. I am a doctor. You should know by now. Dark days and bright nights. We just trying to keep safe. 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 We just trying to, yeah. Sun rays, but no light. No light. But we just trying to keep safe. We just trying to keep safe. We just trying to keep safe. We just trying to, love. We just trying to, love. I got a question. What it do? You should answer that. If you say it, see it through, you the man for that. We on the way, we breaking through, like we ran it back. Right fist, left fist, I'm about to handle that. My glass had food, but you the straw that broke the camel's back. Microphone controller, I can show you how to handle that. Pedal stool holder, had to come through and dismantle that. Told you I am colder, you gon' need more than the flannel jack. We gon' let the people choose, cause we know the panel stat. We wanna be equal too, pay respect and pay it back. I have been on my payments, you negligent, you gon' pay for that. Both feet on the pavement is definite, I was made for that. Fought for civil rights so they could take it back. That was then, this is now, now we need way more than that. Got them waking up, yeah, time to take some shorter naps. Got the corner pieces set, they see where the board is at and they think we can't keep it up. Show me where my hoard is at, Corona went in my A, like over with Florida at. They yelling this real and fake, I got on my sword of cap. I'm just enjoying the break, get through it like quarterbacks. You can hear me, but if you're listening, read the order back. Gotta write it down, way to style, where my order at, your energy. Got me coming down, I ain't order that Now ten of me is how I'm feeling now And that's more than facts Yeah Dark days Bright and nice But we just trying to keep safe We just trying to keep safe Right fist, left fist I'm about to handle that